Hi guys and welcome back to another video. Today I have the Pretty Happy Papiri stationery box. It's this kawaii little bento box. It looks so cute and it's full of beautiful papers and stationery. So I'm so excited to unbox this little bundle of joy. <laughs> it makes me so happy to see. So let's open it up and I'll show you what's inside. So this box has been engraved with the logo and it's also got this beautiful lock at the front here. So we've got this beautifully wrapped, I don't know what's inside, but it's got um, these, I think they're stamps of like moon stamps. So I saw this beautiful box on Instagram and I hadn't contacted her anything before this to let her know that I was buying this box. And it says here that she actually watches my YouTube channel. That makes me so happy. Thank you. This is a gorgeous little note. I think I just need to take a moment to look at how beautifully this is wrapped. So we've got like these little glass, I don't even know what's in here, these look like wax seals maybe? And then look at this gorgeous moon on the front here. This one even has a little moon on the wax seal. We've got something in here. Oh, I can't wait to dive into it. Okay, so I think I'm going to open this one first since it's at the side. And the washi tape has dots on it. <gasps> wow. Look how beautiful the string is. Alright, so I'll do a close up. So what have we got in this bundle of goodies? This one kind of looks like a postcard. It's even got a little stamp here. So delicate and beautiful. I love these. This one looks like a big moon. And there's writing on it. A little homemade envelope. And it's got a hand holding the moon. Also, sorry if you can hear some background noise. I'm, I live right next to a construction site. This one actually looked like it's been tea dyed, like she might have tea dyed that herself. Beautiful papers. I can't wait to put all of these in my journal. Even that's gorgeous. This is a little sticker sheet. And then I think the rest is old papers. music sheet and then what have we got inside of here so this again two old papers can you see the little sewn strip so it's a little pocket that's been sewn looks like she's handmade this one it looks like a lot of these things have been handmade i really want to create my own box like this it inspires me so much <gasps> Oh, look at these. Oh my goodness. Sorry, I'm going to say oh my goodness a lot. This one says Night Thinker. Oh, we've got little... I think these have been stamped on. They're gorgeous. And this is like a, a moon theme, this one. Like stars and moons, if you haven't um, picked up on that. I love that. These are so cute. I can't wait to see what journal spreads I'm gonna make out of these. Even like something like that is just beautiful. I wanna go rummaging through your collection. <laughs> Thank you. So let's have a look at what's inside this box. I really wanna see what these are. This is so pretty. So it's this little glass bottle with a cork inside. And she's beautifully decorated with this bit of lace. So let's see all of these wax seals. So these are all the little wax seals that were inside. As you can see, there's like little buttons, moons, ones that say with love. Gorgeous, thank you. So next, I think this is a little rubber stamp. And I can't 
can't read the middle word. It's under the something moon. I'm going to have to stamp it to see. I'm really not great with runner writing. <laughs> but this is gorgeous. How beautiful. So next we have this beautiful journal. And I really don't want to open it up because this moon here is just so pretty. This little piece of, I don't know if that's real, I think it's a real dried um, flower. And then everything here is just gorgeous. But it looks like it's really pretty inside, so I'm going to have to open it up to show you. But I think I'm going to like delicately slide this off. <gasps> Even this is wrapping as well. So this little journal definitely looks handmade. You can see at the side, you can see like the binding. Okay, so let's open it up and see what's inside. <gasps> oh my goodness, are these handmade papers? You can see like the flower flakes throughout the page. Oh, this one's gorgeous, fell on paper. And then this beautiful like bluey black one. This one kind of looks like cork, but they definitely, yeah, they definitely look handmade. Oh, wow. What am I going to do with this journal? I'm going to have to do something very special. Oh, I love that one. Can you see the texture in that one? How gorgeous. Thank you. This is so lovely. All right, so I think I will just keep going through this one here. So we've got this handmade pouch on this beautiful tag here. So as you can see, there's like these ticket stubs. Some papers at the back here. And then we've even got little tiny tags. Beautiful stickers. And then it's all beautifully put together at the front here with these dried flowers. And then the back's just plain. This is just a work of art in itself. So next we have these beautiful washi tape samples. And they're really artsy. I like them. Because they're not too textured and they usually work with a lot of different designs. I love that one. So next inside the box, we've got this stack of handmade papers. Now these actually look like the handmade papers that were in the journal. It's put together with this beautiful leaf, the moon and stars since it's a moon and star theme. We've got this ripped paper that runs all the way to the back here with this beautiful washi tape. And then on the very front, there's this gorgeous purple wax seal. I'm not going to open this one up, but I will give you a flip through of what's inside. So again, there's just like these beautiful handmade papers, similar to the ones that were in the journal. So at the very bottom, we've also got this lovely thank you note. And I think it's been printed onto this gorgeous paper. It's so delicate and small. Next, I think we have a bundle of tags and I think they're going to be moon themed. But I don't want to open it. <laughs> I love this so much. It's a wax seal and it's got the little circle in the middle so you can tie it onto the front of a package. And then it's this gorgeous moon that's been painted on with gold. But I will have to open it because one day I'm going to have to use all of these papers up. I was right, so we've got these beautiful tags. So let's see what tags are in here. I'd love to know where you find all these, if you just go searching for these in different shops or if you collect them over the years or if you have like a go-to place. I just love knowing where papers come from. It's like there's a history behind them. Like even something as delicate as that, like is that handmade? I think they tell a story. Do you know how trees have lifelines? And you can count the rings of how long a tree's been alive for. It's like the same with paper. 
I feel like you find dates or you find that the lettering was from a certain time or a ticket stub may say a date on it or someone may have delicately like handmade something like even that like the little mushroom some of them look like they're like from cashier but I know a lot of these have been remade to make them look old but even something like that like is that from an artist like you just don't know like did someone design that that could be from like a library card I just feel like they all tell a story like something like that where would they have found those designs did an artist make it did they print it out from an old magazine I just love <gasps> that you can get a feeling of this history behind it that's so cool Okay, I think we're back at the start. A very generous selection of papers there. So this is the next little thing out of this box and as you can see I think this is a little moon again like the last one. Beautifully wrapped. And then I think they're all the same papers. So it's just these beautiful papers that I'm going to use throughout my journaling. So I'm going to pop that one back. I'm going to keep these ones. So this is the last thing in the box today. How lovely are these three little twines? Can't wait to start wrapping things. I'm going to use the idea of getting some wax seals or little moons and gold accents to create little bundles. Alrighty, so that was the last thing in this box. Let me know in the comments what you thought of this beautiful bundle of goodies. Um, I had a really fun time opening it. It's not only the stationery that I received, but it's the experience you have with it. Um, and yeah, I just thought everything was so gorgeous. So thank you so much. I'm going to post some photos on Instagram if you want to see a few more things in detail. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Thanks for watching. Bye.